So, Happy New Year. Today is January 1st, 2022. And it's also Haitian's Independence Day. Haiti's Independence Day. So, Happy New Year and Happy Independence Day to all the Zoes that's out there. I want you guys to take a look at this um, HVAC training, electrical training hookup that I done hooked up and basically you know I did this all on my own based on the knowledge that I learned from Lincoln Tech and based on the knowledge that I've acquired on YouTube through acservicetech.com so this is their hookup it's not the pretty version right now it's the it's the basically the bird's nest version but everything is safe as far as I know Anyway, I'm going to run this and see how it works. What happens is, actually, I changed it up a little bit because I have a little switch in, into my system. But basically, when I turn on my switch, I'm now powering my transformer, my 24-volt transformer, which powers the thermostat, gives power to the thermostat. I have everything hooked up like AC Tech says. So if that means uh, everything is hooked up right, then it should work. All right. Forgive me if I sound a little nervous because, you know, you just, I'm not electrical engineer. I'm a structural engineer. But when I turn this fan on, guess what? I get my fan motor ro running as I should. So I just turned on the fan. That's just like turning on the fan to your air conditioning system at home. So this is a, a system that's an AC and gas, oil, or electric furnace. But um, right now we're treating it like as if it's gas and oil. Alright, so that's on. Everything is running fine. The fan, the fan that's kind of like the easy stuff. So turn that off. Now I'm going to turn on my cooling, which will turn on my compressor and turn on the condenser fan at the same time so I turn on the cooling voila that beep you heard was for my fan that I have hooked up here as you can see both fans are working just fine that standing fan would be like the compressor as far as I understand <laughs> all right um the next step is to check the heating mode okay now when I turn on the heating mode it's going to turn on this light bulb right here and it kind of signifies my um, it, it represents my my furnace in this case and that's going to send a heating element it's going to light up it's going to heat up my sequencer so while the gas furnace is burning and it's getting the heat exchanger working the the sequencer um, we'll be controlling the fan uh, and so we don't want that to come on oh, man. So, got a phone call decline for a second all right we'll come back all right so we're going to turn on this turn off this fan turn off the cooling mode let's turn on the heat the light should come on and then my sequencer should activate, which is then going to activate the um, the fan, the blower fan in the system from the fan relay. So turn on the light. Voila. And bear with me. Give it some time because it's a sequencer. It has to heat up and it's a heat switch. Lo and behold. Yours truly, truly did it. <laughs> so there it is, party people. Leo D doing his thing in 2022. New times. <laughs>